Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Even though outside is raining, I want to make something uh, bright and colorful today. So let's get started. For my base, I will use Estelle Del Multi Effect uh, 3 Peptide uh, Face and Neck Cream and Resilience Multi Effect Eye Cream. Even though it's a cream for lifting for age 30 plus, I really like the texture because it's more whipped, more dense and it makes my skin so glowy. Now we start applying the cream. And a trick I like to use, I like to use a little bit of eye cream on my lips because it's a bomb texture and it keeps hydrating my lips. Also, I've got a sample from Douglas and I want to try uh, Estelle Oder, a Radiant Base. I'll start by applying a small amount with a foundation brush. After I apply my base, I like to come again with my fingers and blend the base to be more evenly. For foundation, I will mix two shades from Excel Oder Double Wear, staying in place, 3 and 1 and 1 and 1. And to make my foundation a little bit more lighter, I will use some um, pro, pro Foundation Mixer from NYX in the shade White Blank. And to blend my foundation, I will try today foundation brush from Douglas. It's a Christmas edition. I always like to apply my foundation using a brush, then coming again with a blender, beauty blender. You might hear the rain outside. Unfortunately, I can't stop that. mask effect I will try to blend my foundation as far as possible on my lip so it won't be as visible for concealer I will use camouflage cream from uh, Catrice in shade ivory And I will also apply with the flat concealer brush from Douglas. Same collection as the foundation. I like to apply big, big triangles under my eyes. My chin, upper lip, on the nose bridge, and in the middle of my forehead. Of my face, I'll use Beyond Perfecting from Clinique in a darker shade CM52 Neutral. And I will come and 
blend it with the foundation brush. And if I want to give my lips a little bit more volume, I will apply also a small amount on my lips. And I will contour my nose a little bit. set the base in place. I will use an all-time favorite from Rimmel London. Yes, shade uh, one transparent. And the thing I like to do, I will take a big amount of um, powder on my brush and I'll dab it. I don't have any creases under my eyes, I will blend it with my finger and then applying the powder. To contour my face I will use uh, from Fenty Beauty Instant Warm Bronzer in Sun Shady Beads. Hopefully, I read it all. An illuminating bronzing powder in shade Antigua from Bobbi Brown. And to apply it, I will use a Morphe brush. I really don't know the number of it because I it's an old favorite of mine, and the number wiped off. I will use the soft palette, the highlighting palette. And for a highlighter, I will use a MAC brush in the number A37. try to make the fluffy brows that everyone makes now online and I will start uh, by using a Miss Sporty uh, eyebrow pencil and then I will follow with the next professional makeup tinted brow mascara in espresso I will do the eyebrows and I will be right back so my eyebrows are done. If you would like a more detailed tutorial with uh, how I do my eyebrows or you would like me to try new makeup trends or new uh, makeup, share your ideas in the comment section down below. The next thing that I will do, I will start doing the um, eye makeup. For that I will use three eye palettes because I like to blend the colors so they won't show like straight lines. Firstly, I will start by using a Fixie eyeshadow palette, palette. Uh, the Revolution Pro, a colorful one, and Ring the Alarm from Morphe and Jacqueline Hill.
So the eyes are almost done. Next I will use an eyeliner from NYX uh, Cosmetics, that's the point. And the mascara from My Cosmetics in Extreme Dimension 3D Black Lash Mascara. And to give my eyes a little bit more dimension and make it a little bit more dramatic, I will use a cold pencil from Estelle Oder in shade 1 Onyx. And for my lips today I will use a NYX lip pencil in shade natural and a kickoff lipstick in shade velvet something. I don't know, I can't read the name because it's not all one. everything in place and to make up to and for the makeup to last a little bit more longer I'll use a Morphe continuous mist setting spray so there's the makeup done
I hope you like it. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And see you next time. Bye.